Hello everybody, it's me, it's me, it's D.A.B., the one and only, and welcome back to the Final Fantasy II LP. Okay guys, we, uh, in the last episode, we were told we need to acquire the Goddess Bell so we can handle Sunfire, and to do that we had to go talk to Joseph who knew the location, which led us to the Snow Cavern. So while we're here, we are going to find the Goddess Bell. Now guys, I don't know if this is in the PSP version, I know it's not in the Game Boy Advance version, sure as hell wasn't in the NES version, the thing I'm liking about this version is, there's a map of the floor. Very detailed, shows you where treasure chests are. We're gonna abuse the hell out of that in this game. And even though I know this is a big area, I'm probably gonna show most of the fights unless it starts getting really time consuming, okay? Need some money? That's not a whole lot of money. We'll just try to work our way through it. But you know, guys, I'm gonna say, uh, a bit rudimentary. I'm liking the game a lot more than I thought I would. I went into this one thinking it was going to suck, and I haven't hit the... I've watched Let's Plays and stuff, and I played this game a little tiny bit on the Game Boy Advance. I didn't get particularly far. Good job, guy. So, I don't know what the later dungeons are going to be like. I know there's one that's really going to suck, and I'll talk about it when we get to it. Maria, what was that? You can do way better than 30 damage. Especially if I let her use her magic, but, you know, we, we, we're not wasting MP right now. What do we have here? 300 gil, I will take it. Yeah, because, guys, uh, counter rate's a bit ridiculous in here, but I think we can handle. I think we can manage. I'm going to need to find enemies. that you know, I, I want to try something after this next fight, okay? Or, you know what? Yeah, yeah, I think we... Oh, oh, okay. You know what? Thunder. Cure. Uh, you also cure. And y you just defend. Is that enough to take them all out? It wasn't, really. A cure four will definitely do it. And hey, Maria got some HP, even though she didn't get hit in the fight. But you know what? I'm cool with it. Maria's going to need hit points most of all. Even hiding in the back. Another 350 gil. Okay, see, we're, we're racking that money right back up. Because endgame stuff gets real expensive. Because we're going to want to buy... Like, I looked into prices and everything in this game. Elixirs that can restore our HP and MP. They're like 50,000 gil or something ridiculous like that. Hey, good job, Joseph. Uh... Oh. It's frozen, right. Okay. Why? Just beat him up. Good job, guy. <laughs> Just keep doing what you do best, buddy. I wish there had been Mithril Axes, though, because as good a damage as he's doing... Like, let me see something real quick. Firion, his strength is 33. His attack is 52. Guy's is 42. And he has higher strength. It's because Firion is wielding a pair of uh, mithril longswords. Oh, wait. Yeah, okay. I'm sure there's nothing in here. We're gonna test it any- What the hell are these? M Maria, can you light them up? You too, guy. You have fire. They look like they'd be weak to fire, right? And they sure were. Oh, but those are new enemies. I should try hitting them with weapons to see if, like, they'll increase my stuff. This is a dead end room. It sure is. But hey, we made it out. We're good. We got a ghoul along with the zombie this time. Light him up, buddy. You too. You make sure they can't use magic. Can you just attack? Sure, punch him. Punch him right in the face. Already doing 185 damage. You love to see it. What did he just do? Okay, so Furion's paralyzed. Does that remain after the fight or not? No, he's good. Okay, cool. 
the treasure chest over there, we want that. I don't know which one of these we want to do first. Just, just punch them. They didn't seem to have that many hit points. Okay, so yeah, with their multiple hits, they'll take them. Their defense is pretty damn high. Still nothing that's letting us raise our weapon skill. Well, I can understand Guy and Furion, but not Maria. Why? What the hell are these? Take, take them out. Um... How does the thunder spell work on them? Okay, they don't have that much for hit points. We're okay. Are these things we can grind up our weapon stats on? Really? Still nothing, huh? An arctic wind? I think that's like a, a one-time use item. Yeah, it just does ice damage. Okay. So guys, I don't know which way we want to go first. I'm going to take the northern path. What is a... A shadow? Okay. Well, you guys know what I'm doing. Yeah, light them up. You just defend for the turn. Let's see what happens here. What's a nice cure for do to him? Well, they don't have all that much for hit points, so we're good. And Guy got hit points for doing nothing. I love to see it. Uh, we'll just punch this. Guy, I am going to start skipping fights again, because now it's starting to take a toll on my time. Unless we so show some enemies that we hadn't seen before. I am genuinely curious why we're not leveling up our weapon stats anymore. Yeah, some things in here really don't like fire. Um, okay, just treasure. That's cool. Definitely going to cut any fights we encounter down here. I, I guess I'll show off the grenade. I haven't fought one of those before. I hope the grenade doesn't go first. Fury, and you're normally pretty quick. But they're still weak. Maria, hell yeah, get more hit points, man. Alright, I'm gonna go to the far end first and get that one. I'll get the other two on the way back. Knowing my luck, I did this all wrong. And there's gonna be like a monster in the box at this one or something. That was a guess! Alright, what are we dealing with? Oh, oh no. No, no! I don't like that they're getting the ambush. I'm on edge. Okay. Just blow them all up. Just blow them all up, okay? Everybody, just use your magic. Take them all out in one fell swoop. This might do it, honestly. They're, they're not really strong. Yeah, cool. We're, we're done with that. What do we get for that? A mithril mace? Okay, not going to use it. Probably going to sell that, but that's fine. Guys, I did not notice till that last fight. Hey, we got an antidote. Also, now that I have... First of all, poison ends after a fight. I'm probably never going to use antidotes. They're kind of worthless. A, bat a battle axe. Isn't that the... Don't we have that already? Yeah, we have battle axes. Damn it! Well, it's cool. We're getting more treasure to sell later. That's fine. But, uh... Yeah, just like that, we got our gill right back up to five grand. And I only wasted time grinding it out before because the spells I wanted were a thousand gill apiece, so... And I wanted to leave with, you know... I wanted to leave with, like, some money in case something came up, and as you saw, it did, and I didn't have enough for my airship fare. Oh, by the way, guy finally broke a thousand hit points. Hooray! 
Our meat tank is doing what he does. Come on, get down there. Alright, what level is this? Fourth floor. Okay, there's a couple treasure chests. Quite a few treasure chests. Okay, this one's gonna take a minute. I'm not really using potions. I'm more using cure outside of battle to level it up more. Ooh, a blizzard tome that I guess I don't really need? If you don't put the tome on somebody, you can use it as an item, and I don't remember what level it casts it at, but we're not gonna do that. I'll probably sell it. Right, get our treasures down here, and we can make our way out of this level. What do we got? Good stuff. Another potion. Oh, so speaking of leveling uh, spells up while we're here, Guy has done a lot less. I'll let him cure everybody up. Yep, 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 and yep. Most of that wasn't even damage, most of that was just from leveling. And what do we get here? A mithril spear. Okay, that's cool. I'm, I'm not going to use a spear on anybody, but it's cool. I'm positive this is a trap room with nothing in it. And I was right. But hey, at least we didn't have to fight anything. Man, I've probably cut, like, at least three minutes worth of fights out of this video already. <laughs> Alright, what do we got going on here? It's treasure treasure and there's two doors i'm gonna assume that one at the bottom right is the one we want to go through so let's do a sweep okay and also it's like i know i said i wasn't going to grind so much during re regular gameplay like while i'm let's playing what we got a mithril shield i'm probably never gonna use i don't really seem to use shields i like to dual wield instead um but anyways maybe it gets later in the game and stuff starts getting hard i'll use shields when I'm fighting all these undeads, I am absolutely, like, leveling up Maria and Guy's cure and life spells because they're not always working, but, like, it's good to get life leveled up higher than, like, two or three so you come back with more than just a single hit point or a chance of it failing in battle. I don't want that to happen. Is there anything in here? Am I wasting my time? Wasting my time. And as though insult to injury were needed, we had a fight right before we left the door. Well, I got guys fire up to level 4, so that's pretty cool. But yeah, guys, you're seeing now why, like, in a lot of Let's Plays, including this one, monsters! What are the monsters? Don't be an ambush. Is it an ambush where they all get to go first? They don't. Okay, so. Let's try out warp and see what happens. You do a cure. Guy, do life. Joseph, just defend. I want to see what happens. Assuming this doesn't just wipe them all out in one blow. Oh, he's blind now. That's bad. He looks cool. Guy with his deal with it sunglasses. Okay. That, that was fun for a minute. We're not doing that again. Uh, you try life. See if it works. And then y you get to do a, a cure this time. Punch one. Okay, guys, you see the life spell doesn't always work. But Cure will do a lot of damage to them. And if they were guarding this box, there was something they didn't want us to get. Ooh, we get... I feel that's a bad weapon. I don't remember. Guy still has his sunglasses. Do we have eye drops? We do. There you go, buddy. I love the image of him We're just wearing sunglasses. It's so cool. You know what? Let, let's see. Let, let's see what this sword does. I don't like how much the... What, what does it do? You know what? I, I'm not going to use it for right now. Just something about that accuracy drop I don't care for. Guy's Evasion has leveled up for me. Not at all the entire time I've been playing this game. It's leveled up twice in this dungeon alone. Is this that legendary moment? I believe it is. Giant Beaver Snook Chit. Snook Chit. 
Snook Snook Chit? Guy Speak Beaver. Snook Snook Chit? Really? Asking about the Goddess Bell. Secret Passage in Wall to Right. Monster Guard Bell. Bell in Wall. Okay. Where? Oh, okay. That was not the fight we were waiting for. Oh, there's a whole nother level here. Okay. Oh my goodness. Guys, I don't know how long this is going on your end, but I know on my end this has been taking quite some time. Onward. Also, really quick, just thinking about it. Because his MP is so low. Well, what's his magic stat, even? He still has a magic stat of 10, so if he gets any SP at, or MP at all, it's going to jump up 10 points, so that's something. But he has no spells, so I don't... I shouldn't have talked. Now i got to show the fight. Do a life spell, just because you can. You're probably not going to get the chance. Oh, he did. I was hoping you guys get to see what it looks like. A little biblically inaccurate cher uh, cherub comes down and just taps you on the nose. And to the undead, it just kills him. Guy, you getting all the hit points, buddy. It's just a long road. Nothing interesting to say. No treasure chests. I'm kind of surprised there, like... I guess proportionally we're not wasting a lot of MP. But, like, I'm using so much magic in here almost every fight, I would expect someone's MP to have gone up a little tiny bit by now. So we fought those two heads again. Oh! Oh! That's the monster that guard Bell. Get a Silver Curus. Okay, guys. Let's do this. Joseph, that's an Adamantois guarding the bell. Stay on your toes. I probably should have healed before the fight, huh? Oh, well. Whatever. We'll get through it. Okay, you hit him with a thunder. You hit him with a blizzard. You hit him with, uh, does it no magic? Hit it with a silence just to be safe? I, or, you know what? No, cure the party. Joseph. Use that Antarctic wind on it. How does thunder do? Not the best. How does Blizzard 4 do? That's what we want to see. Oh my god, this thing has a lot of hit points. Oh, it does 16, level 16? Holy crap. Okay, so it wasn't that scary, I guess. Yeah, Adamantoises have ridiculously high defense, but their magic defense sucks. And I think they're weak to ice element attacks, so use those. Good job, Virion. Good job, Joseph. Nobody got SP. God dang it, guys. There it is. There's something set in the wall. It's the Goddess Bell. We got the Goddess Bell. Let's get out of here. Oh, that's what that was. It, okay, it's just a one way out of here. Cool. Good to know. You know, guys, I think we're doing damn good here. Took a while, but I think we did very well. Oh, no. Bergen. What the hell are you doing here? Borgen, sorry. Curses. You've already gotten to the goddess's bell. First you ruined my standing with the emperor, and now this... The Emperor will never forgive me for messing this up. If I ever go back to the Empire, he'll have my head. But I'm still a soldier. If I'm going to die, you're coming with me! Oh, get fucked. Oh my god, you look so goofy. Just, just... Hit him with your sword. You... Hit him with ice. Hit him with... Punch him. Okay, cool. Yeah, he was he was a soldier, all right. I the Adamantois took so much more damage than this guy, and he got a much slower dissolve. But he's worth six hundred gil, so that's something. The 
we just walk around him? Uh, <laughs> I may have lost, but don't think that you've won. I've booby-trapped this cave. Just a little parting gift from me to you. I'll be waiting for you in hell. Ugh. Oh, we did kill him. That was it. He's dead. But he Indiana Jones is us. Go, 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 go. Damn it! Joseph, Jesus. Go on. Get out. No. We not leave you. I can't hold it much longer. Run! It's up to you. Now, Variant. My sweet Nelly. Joseph! And he blinked away. That's how you know he's gone. It is really depressing to me. I like Joseph. Well, guys, we have the Goddess Spell, but at what cost? I'm going to make my way back to Salamand. And once there, we'll regroup and we'll figure out what we're going to do from here out. I think... I think we had to go... I, I, I'll look it up in a second. We were told where we had to go. It's where the Dreadnought flew to. But we'll worry about that in the next part. So thank you for watching, everybody. Until next time.